Well, hey guys, it's Mandy with Sweetly Home, and I have been tagged for the fall decor home tag, and I'm so stinking excited about it. I love fall. I know, like, there's a lot of people that love fall. You are my people. <laughs> I am not a summer girl whatsoever. Give me fall, give me crunchy leaves, give me cold weather, give me hot drinks, the soup simmering on the stove, and all the delicious smells of fall. I crave it all year long. October is my favorite month. <laughs> so I am so excited to do this tag. I was tagged by Faith Mom Life and Brandis from Mrs. Love Above All. I'll have both their channels linked down below. These women are so incredible and so inspiring and uplifting. So if you're looking for that kind of content here on YouTube, make sure you uh, check out both those gals. So we're gonna get in to this tag, yay. Okay, so question number one is, when do you decorate for fall? Today is September 7th. This is back to school day for us here. And I had it in my plan to decorate for fall today. Or was it tomorrow? I think it's tomorrow. Um, I really try and do it as soon as I can. Um, but however, here lately, it has been hot. It's been, I'm in Northern Ontario, Canada, and it is like, unbelievable. The Humidex is like well into the 90s and it's sticky and it just doesn't feel very fall like. So um, I could see in my time hop on Facebook that I um, a few days ago I'd had all my decor up last year. It's just not that case yet. So tomorrow is when I hope to get it all up. So as soon as possible once September 1st hits. So question number two is what is your fall style? So I think it kind of changes from year to year just a little bit. Um, when I was younger and <laughs> I used to decorate with like fall leaves and like picks with like berries and um, I want to say popcorn but it's not popcorn, it's pine cones. Um, scented cinnamon pine cones and potpourri. Um, <laughs> so that was kind of my style. Now it's um, lends more towards like white pumpkins and even orange pumpkins. So I, I fight that um, wanting to be completely neutral and wanting to be super kind of rustic and like warm woods and like barn woods and uh, lots of like colorful pink uh, pink pumpkins. My tongue is not working today. <laughs> um, like orange pumpkins and um, you know just all of that um, so it just kind of changes year to year and I kind of just allow myself just to feel the way that I am um, with that particular season so last year I did a lot of decorating with lots of blacks and oranges and chevron and kind of a little bit more um, polka dots and things like that a little more patterns involved this year I'm thinking that I'm gonna be leaning a little bit more towards um, neutral and rustic and very natural sort of feeling. Question three is what is your favorite to store to shop for for fall? And my favorite store is actually a greenhouse or a pumpkin patch. Like I really love to get real pumpkins and real stuff into my home. Um, don't get me wrong, I have a ton of full pumpkins and the whole nine yards, but I just absolutely love going to the greenhouse or to a pumpkin patch and picking up those natural, actual elements and bringing them into my home. So that's the first place that I go, but the second place is of course some place like HomeSense here in Canada or like Home Goods. that's what it is in the state. So one of those type stores with very unique, you know, pieces that they just have kind of a few of and you gotta snag it right away or else it's gonna be gone. Question number four is, how many pumpkins do you own? I don't know. <laughs> I have a lot. Um, I just bought four the other day. Um, I love, love, love pumpkins. Um, crazy known fact, little known fact, I, um, read a book a few years ago about how to grow your own pumpkin patch and my dream is to have a big pumpkin patch that I could kind of feed my pumpkin addiction from and I would love to have a farm one day and have um, just like a whole area where people can come and buy pumpkins 
and you know have like fresh cider and like a little country shop and maybe corn mazes and that kind of thing that would be so right up my alley question number five is do you decorate outside of your home and we have uh, I don't know if we will so much this year and the reason I say that we may not is because we have a lot of outside work to do on our home um, we did a whole home renovation for like the past several years and the outside is still kind of in that completion phase we need to put on like a new um, front deck we just have like a temporary step and some more siding and a garage door and a whole bunch of junk that needs to be done out front so apart from putting out a pretty wreath and likely some mums and okay some pumpkins like okay so I, I guess I am kind of decorating but I wouldn't go all out as I would if our whole front was completed um, in years past we've had hay bales out with mums and pumpkins and wreaths and it was like kind of really super cute um, now it's like putting lipstick on a pig uh, it's ugly sort of because some of it's all done and really nice looking but there's other parts that just aren't so it's lipstick on a pig really Question number six is, do you host Thanksgiving at your house? And yes, I do. Um, for all the years that we were out of our house while we were renovating, of course I didn't. But um, prior to that, we had Thanksgiving here, and we had Thanksgiving here. Well, I guess we didn't have Thanksgiving here. Maybe I'm confusing this with Christmas. We had Thanksgiving at my house before we renovated. But I guess the trend has been that we do go to my in-law's house. It kind of just depends. We're very last minute on it all. Um, we have lots of family that comes over and um, my dining area is pretty small. Um, my mother-in-law's is a bit bigger. Um, but we just kind of go with how we feel because sometimes it makes more sense to have uh, a dinner like at our house so the kids can kind of you know get into their stuff. But in years past we have been going to my mother-in-law's for it's always fun to host. Question seven, what is your favorite fall food to cook? So this is kind of a two answer thing for me. I'll tell you my favorite thing to cook is um, just soup on the stove. Like, ugh, there's just nothing like simmering a pot of delicious soup and having biscuits, like homemade biscuits or um, like muffins um, with soup for dinner. Like, I love that. However, the thing that I'm known for cooking is a sweet potato casserole that um, is like sugar and so stinking delicious. Um, everybody, whoever has it, asks for the recipe. It is like sugar and sweet potatoes and lots of butter. And it is like out of this world of these balls. It's so good. But we only have it for and a funny thing, I live in Canada, but I'm American, and Canada actually has their Thanksgiving in October, and of course in the States we have it in November, so I celebrate twice, <laughs> once in October and once in November, so um, we usually have like a turkey dinner for um, the American Thanksgiving, so
love anything. I love cold and cinnamon in it. Um, just anything. I don't know. I just, I love them all. If it's designated like a fall type scent, chances are I'm going to love it. And question number 10 is, what is your favorite room to decorate for fall in your home? making little displays in my kitchen because I'm here a lot. I'm right now. <laughs> um, but yeah, I think that's that would be it because I can put up little um, vignettes with like more breakable pieces because uh, I just have some spots that people aren't really touching and I don't have to worry about little two-year-old hands getting into everything. So that is it for this fun little tag. I'm going to tag a few ladies down below. If you would like to do this tag, by all means, please just do it. Um, I know sometimes I haven't done a tag because I thought, why would you tag me? I'd be silly. But you know what? Don't don't feel that way. Don't be in me and just do it. And leave a comment down below letting me know that you did the tag. Um, if you don't have a channel and just want to answer some of the questions, I'd love to hear your thoughts. Like I said, if you like fall, you are my people. <laughs> um, Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and pretty soon I should have up my fall decor video or maybe videos. I'm not really sure. Um, yeah. <laughs> I hope you guys have a really great day and I will talk to you soon. Bye. Okay. So. <laughs> Uh, yes, 